Hello, this is Sandat here, back with another Kaizgo Sentai Gokaiju review. This time we have the Ranger Key Set 01. Um, this is five keys, Geki Red, Deka Red, Magi Red, Gal Red, Vol Eagle. Um, this is how most keys are going to get released. Uh, the rest probably being Gashapon, um, I'm thinking, and other weapons and such. But you get the basic idea, you got text there, you got thing here. By the way, this retails for a thousand yen. Um, and I've gotten this, I got this from Amiyami, um, because I was there at the right time. And, yeah, it's a thousand yen, so, I mean, it does sell out pretty quickly, because people can mostly afford it. Um, because it's not that expensive to get. And you got all the other keys, you got, they turn into a key, it goes into that stuff that I have, and these are on the way, and I'm really excited. But yeah, basically, it's kind of like the O's metal sets. Um, you have the piece of cardboard, and then you got the plastic. Um, and from the back, you can not tell who they are unless you memorize the uh, serial number. But, um, but yeah, it just it opens like that. There's, there's not much to this packaging. So let's get this started. So I'm going to do these keys in the order of their Sentai. Um, so Sun Vulcan is the oldest key, or Vol Eagle here from Sun Vulcan. It's the oldest uh, Sentai warrior that's been made into a key so far. Makes me giddy with excitement because 70s and 80s Sentai and 70s and 80s Common Riders are just awesome. I love them. They're so cheesy, but I love them. Um, and with the Go Ranger set coming out, I can't wait for that. Um, anyway, so you have Vol Eagle. He's got a new head. He looks awesome. I really like the Sun Vulcan suits. Um, I mean, it's the only Sentai team to have three members, never adding any members. Um, Red died and got replaced. And it's the only team never have any females either, so interesting. Um, but yeah, basically, he goes and folds up, and here he is. Uh, you got the Sun Vulcan logo there, and you have copyright. Why? Well, they had to have it somewhere on the toy, and even though this is a set, they had to put it somewhere. So it's stuck right there on Sun Vulcan, um, or Vol Eagle's key. He is R027. Yeah, that bugs me. I'll have to figure something out. Anyway, of course, it works with the Mobirates. Oh, I just love doing that. So we'll... So Sun Vulcan plus generic noise and and the Sun Vulcan little thing. So next we have Gao Red um, from the 25th Super Sentai series. Um, he's looking all Gao Red-ish. Um, he's got his one stripe there, even though it should have five little lines. But I'm not gonna nitpick. This is a tiny little key. Um, not much else to say. I mean, it's basic Ranger Key stuff. Um, he looks cool. Uh, there's the Gower Ranger logo, which I've always liked, because it's like the combination of all the animals that made a face. Um, he is number 131. Um, and it works in this thing, which I'm just gonna do this down here, because I don't feel like zooming out again. So, Gal Ranger plus generic noise, and... And the Gal Ranger will call something. So next we have Decca Red from Decca Ranger, Tokuso Sentai Decca Ranger. I like this design um, with the whole one thing. I always like that part about the Decca Ranger shoots, um, the, the numbers. And... What's pretty awesome is they put in a full tampo graph on his helmet of the little SPD logo, which is freaking awesome. Uh, but there he is. Um, not much else to say. Um, he's the only one with a black arm. And the cool little police dog thing there. And he is number 148. But there you go. Here is awesome little mobirates. Not little. Hey, 
Decker Ranger plus generic noise and and SP Togoso Sentai Decker Ranger. So now we have Magi Red, um, who doesn't have a cape, but that's okay because I don't imagine how they would do that. Um, he's all Magi Red. Not much else to say. Um, he's Magi Red. He's from Magi Ranger. There is the Magi Ranger logo, and that paint scratch is getting worse and worse. Um, or sticker scratch. Anyway, you got uh, R155 as his number. Um, yeah. So here we go. Magi range plus generic noise. So you got the little Magi Ranger uh, roll call thing. So now we have Geki Red as the final key in this set, and he is from Geki Ranger, so he is awesome. Um, I've yet to watch Geki Ranger, I just watch clips. Um, they even molded in his little, like, or painted in his little claw things, um, which is, I thought was cool. Um, but yeah, basically, same thing as normal. Uh, little tiger claw thing. And we have R167. So without further ado, let's get this in here. Geki Ranger plus explosion noise. So is Ranger key set zero one worth it? I say yes only if you have a Mobirates. Don't go out and buy this just because it's in stock. You will not enjoy it. It's not enough on its own. Even though it is just twelve dollars. Still, it's just a bunch of little figures that essentially don't look great because they have to turn into keys. Um but if you're a Ranger Key Collector, go for it. If you just, like, say Magi Red's your favorite uh, Senshi, which I, I can see why, go for the Gashapon. You can get one off CS Toys, probably, if they ever get the Gashapon set. Probably for, like, $6, or on eBay for, like, 10 I mean, it's not going to... Well, then that's kind of redundant, because you might as well just buy the set. But these are going to be rare sets, and... I can recommend it only to Ranger Key Collectors. If you're not collecting the Ranger Keys, it's probably not worth it. Um, but anyway, this is the first of three sets that have been announced. Second set will be Abba Red, Go Red, Rear Ranger, um, and two others I can't think of the names of. And then set three will be Aka Ranger, Mido Ranger, Key Ranger, Ao Ranger, and Momo Ranger. And then the Gashapon set, there is Five Red, Goggle Red, and Mask Red, or Red Mask, um, depending on the way it's Romanized. Um, so, lots of more keys, plus Gokai Silver stuff. Um, anyway, so, expect more reviews in the future. Um, later this week I should be getting Gokai Gun and Gokai Saber, so expect that. Uh, I'm excited to get those. But yeah, stay tuned for more Gokaiju reviews, as eventually I will have all 200 keys, as long as Bandai is willing to make them. And I'm pretty sure they are. So anyway, Tonksen, Sound Sound Sound, goodbye.